Hey everyone, welcome to another short little video here. It's Lance Morgan. We are live. Happy for, uh, Wednesday. It's Wednesday at night. Just got done with a lot of appointments and I uh, just wanted to give you a quick little video on the easiest way to get more free money for college. I know I've talked about the easiest way to reduce the cost of college, which is to go to college in less time. So that leads to proper career planning and uh, making sure you choose colleges that have good graduation rate numbers and all that kind of stuff. But tonight I just wanted to leave you with a quick message about the easiest way to get more free money for college, which is to ask for it. So right now, a lot of people have gotten their award letters back if you have a senior in high school, and you can negotiate those. I, it's called the award appeals process, and each school will have a different process. Some schools are very official, and they make you fill out a specific form and things like that. In other schools, you just talk to the financial aid office, but I would call up the financial aid office and appeal your awards. And it's a simple process, like just a simple negotiation process. And you're basically explaining why you might want, you know, to, or why you want more free money. And basically what you're asking is, is saying, Hey, is this the best you can do? There are several reasons why you might want to appeal. For example, some, if you think about it, if you filled out the financial aid forms, they were using financial financial numbers from two years ago, right? And so there's a good chance that maybe one of the spouses has lost their job. Uh, maybe one of, um, maybe, maybe you have a lot of debt. Maybe, you know, there's a number of situations because when you're filling out those financial aid forms, they're just looking for, you know, the ideal scenario. So they're not asking you about your debt. They're not asking you about your current situation. So a lot of times, the picture that is painted on the financial aid pro forms is not as as accurate it is as it is now and so keep in mind that if you you know if your financial situation has changed or if maybe you have a ex spouse that's not helping you financially and you had to include their information on there whatever the reason is there's a number of reasons or maybe you just want to see if you can get more money because you're looking at two schools and this school offered you maybe a little bit more than this school. And so you say, Hey, you know, we really want to go to your school, but you know, it's going to be, it's going to cost us a little bit more. This school over here is a little bit cheaper. Is there anything you can do? And you know, it's a simple question. Is there any more free money that we might qualify for? So keep in mind, these are businesses, especially private schools. They're all businesses. And you know, there is, a negotiation process involved and it's called the award appeals process. So make sure that you don't just take your award letters at face value and just accept whatever they offer. It never hurts to ask. It's always worth saying, hey, is this the best you can do? Is there any more free money that I qualify for? We had a client once that had a lot of credit card debt based on a past business that had failed. And none of the financial aid asks about the debt that you have. And so we went through an official process and it literally, it, it literally helped him to get about 30,000 more in free money now per year, 30,000 a year more in free money because they factored in his situation and changed his expected family contribution number. Um, lots of families that we work with have a, have a spouse that's not working. They're unemployed. Um, a lot of spouses, unfortunately, we've had family members where family, mem uh, families where family members have become disabled. Um, there's lots of situations that would be a reason for an appeals process. So call the financial aid office, ask them if you can appeal your award letters. It's a great way to do it. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name's Lance Morgan. I'm the founder and owner of College Funding Education and the author of the Retirement Scholarship Strategy book. Um, you can get it on Amazon or you can join us for one of our webinars. We have a webinar at lancewebinar.com. You can also uh, pick up the book on Amazon. You can uh, become one of our VIP clients at collegefundingvip.com. So lots of ways that we can help you out. If you like these videos, we're going to keep giving you a lot of these videos. So if you like them, click the like button, share it with your friends and family, and go out there and appeal those award letters. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Talk to you later.